Welcome, I'm Charmaine Farber with the Principal Innovation Team at Mary Lou Fulton Teachers College at Arizona State University. And I'm excited to introduce you to our reflective card deck to use with teams and in the classroom. This tool is powerful because it's so simple to use. What is it? The Principled Innovation Reflective Card Deck is filled with powerful questions to help you and your team with reflection, conversation, and decision making. And just a quick note that Principled Innovation, or PI, is a framework to help you and your team to imagine new concepts, catalyze ideas, and form new solutions guided by principles that create positive change for humanity. At the heart of principled innovation, we recognize four interconnected clusters of character assets, moral, civic, intellectual performance, that are developed over one's lifetime through self-reflection, working with others, and through learning experiences. The eight practices of principled innovation are demonstrations of assets in action. But don't worry, you don't have to be well-versed or get principled innovation in order to benefit from these powerful questions in the deck. Concepts surrounding collaboration, reflection, design, and character development can sometimes be abstract, but often affect the way we communicate and can contribute to our daily range of emotions. We created the deck to easily explore these concepts and engage the principled innovation framework through using simple yet powerful questions aligned with each practice. Let's take a deep dive into the Principled Innovation Reflective Card Deck. The back of each card displays an infographic of the four PI character assets broken into two practice definitions. The deck also includes a couple of explanatory cards to help you best understand the PI framework. There are two cards each for moral, performance, intellectual, and civic character assets with two practice definitions. All of the questions in the deck are descriptive and not prescriptive, and we offer writing cards so that you can add your own questions to the deck. Let's thumb through some of the engaging questions that you and your team can use to guide critical conversations for reflection or to invigorate classroom discussion. Some of my favorite questions are, what are we missing? Am I recognizing and acknowledging what others are experiencing? And how might we be more resilient as an organization? Diving in and using the card deck questions in your personal or professional life is a great way to get to know principled innovation from the ground up. We offer some example activity cards for how to use the questions in the card deck. The first activity looks at how to use a single question to start a conversation. As a real world example of this activity, a professor in the Mary Lou Fulton Teachers College asks her students to choose a framing question from the civic asset of the card deck before they start a hands-on community-based project. This framing question allows for each student to think more critically about their impact to help a community. This professor explains that often students need to explore their own personal biases and lack of understanding of the challenges a community faces before using the reflective card deck to reflect and discuss. Other activities included in the card deck help you to reflect personally and professionally, as well as to guide learning experiences to help humanity. And now it's your turn. Please email us at pi at asu.edu to get your analog or digital card deck today. We are also interested to hear how you use the cards and your good idea for the next activity that we can publish in our next iteration of the Reflective Card Deck. Again, I'm Charmaine Farber with the Principled Innovation Team at the Mary Lou Fulton Teachers College. Thanks for watching.